pages. I can't even get out 10 words right now. I'm so blocked. I need to make a real den in it tonight though because I won't be able to write tomorrow. I'm going on a date with Steve the Bird Watcher. And tomorrow night, I have another date with Nick Hamilton, that handsome nonfiction writer. <laughs> so Rain and the Dark Bowman, that's the name of my new romance novel, gets all my attention tonight. Actually, I'm just gonna set the alarm. For two and a half hours. That should be plenty of time to write. Okay, now I'm ready. Here we go. Samantha Collins, you are so beautiful. Oh, why thank you, Nick Hamilton. Samantha Collins, you are so smart. Yes, I have the brain of an elephant. What? Oh. Well, I really think that I'm reaching my sexual peak right now. Here it comes. I'm a typing now. Who am I kidding? All you need is one good opening sentence. And as I said before, and as I... Back in the Middle Ages, there was a maiden named Rain who fell in love with the head bowman of her village. Rain tried to do what she thought was sexy to get his attention, like slowly eating a banana. But the head bowman was too busy pacing back and forth and lecturing his young students on the secrets of archery to notice her. People with arrows who don't know how to use them. Ready? Aim. Shoot. She truly believed that if she showed up every day, even with only a banana in her mouth, that someday her dark bowman would finally come to his senses and notice her. And that he did. But only when a younger archer took an interest in her, isn't that always the way? Then Rain thought, if she could prove to her senior archer that she could indeed shoot a bow and arrow, maybe he would look on her with the eyes of true love. And suddenly, Rain was right. The banana was no longer needed. Apparently, showing the head bowman that she was interested in his vocation was all that was needed for him to truly notice her. Oops. Maybe not the best way to go after a man's heart. Hey, nobody said dating was easy. Oh no. 10.30. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. It looks like I wrote something. It was a dark and stormy... Oh god, no. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'll get inspiration from my date tomorrow. After all, a writer needs a muse. Okay. <laughs> I'm feeling better. All I need to do is get some rest. Everything will turn out great tomorrow. Yeah, who am I kidding?